So you call pre-flop with a hand like five, four of hearts, flop comes down with a 10 of hearts, eight of clubs and king of hearts. Awesome, got a flush draw, right? Amazing. That's what a lot of amateurs think, but pros know to play this hand a lot more cagey. They'll probably just check call in this hand. And you know, if there's a lot of big action, if there's a raise and a re-raise, perhaps on the flop or the turn, they'll often just get out of there. But a lot of amateurs, they end up playing a big pot because, oh my God, I got a flush draw. Lo and behold, two hearts comes on the river and you lose a monster pot, perhaps your entire stack actually, versus a hand like ace, jack of hearts. Guys, the solution here is that you always want to be drawing towards the nuts. The biggest problem when you're playing these small little pseudo connectors like a five, four of hearts is you're chasing like the eighth best flush, guys. So you're just begging to get quote unquote unlucky versus a higher flush. 